1854 and I got this child I adore. I immigrated from Europe because I wanted to open a store, but my baby seems abnormal. All the time he's sick, and when I kiss his brow, sweat tastes like salted fish. Mmm, salty sweat, you say? I believe we found the cause today. It's witches, man. I hate to say, but your child could die on any, any day. Read about this in a Swiss book, but I cannot fight magic. There's no cure for being hexed. I admit, this is tragic. And I know you don't know me I wrote a paper by the CF of Van Coney First name Guido Switzerland you see me at I connect the cystic fibrosis with the celiac I have to make him Dorothy Hansen And a American Of diseases for children Published her work She said CF was recessive She categorized the symptoms It was impressive Ayo, Dewey, Rodin and Collins Were my homes They connected CF to the chromosomes It was on number 7 It was a combination of hard work And genetic observation to inform you and you will hate this. Your CFTR gene is mutated. The nucleotide chain is missing three letters. For the rest of your life you won't be feeling better. You see cause your sweat is filled with ions. Your mucus becomes slimy like a python. I'ma pour out one for your dead homies. Your cells didn't recognize your CFTR proteins. What does this mean? I don't understand. I can't understand this jargon like you can. Now let me rephrase my diagnosis. Your child seems to have cystic fibrosis. The implications of this disease are harsh. This is a real deal. Far from the farce. Let me guess now, you're European, that's where the highest frequency is. I don't wanna hear population genetics, just please explain how a human can get this. How could this happen? I have no symptoms. No one in my close family has this affliction. I'm gonna tell you real simple, but don't be frightened. Your gene for CF is heterozygous. The disease is recessive, so unless you have two copies of the CF gene, you ain't gonna get it. It's good to take action now, as the symptoms can get severe. One of them is an obstruction in your rear. A child with CF may not grow normal. They must exercise to clear their alveoli of mucus. But let me tell you about a variety of treatments. To fight infectious, you're going to need antibiotics. A double lung transplant is an option. But you can't go to the store and go lung shopping. Because graft versus host disease does start. When your body rejects your new transplanted parts I feel a lot better in the circumstance I almost feel like I can get up and dance But going back to the potential treatments There's gotta be other ways to treat my ailments Something I can do on the day by day Without having to pay in bales of hay I commend your effort to get your baby tested. It's good to find out if they need medicine. To find out that they have CF must be surprising, but the life expectancy is 50 and rising.
cure for CF is non-existent. Where is it? Research is being done to cure this vicious genetic disease with gene therapy. If the CFTR is present, the symptoms cease to be. So if you'd follow me, you'd see teams of doctors drinking their tea. That green slaving away at this mystery. Who done it? Trying to cure this genetic disease. But before we could know the best treatment, the CFTR gene must be sequenced. Right. If you find yourself a CF patient, it's the result of one of over 80 different mutations. Like them all. Another form of research that is cool is a cocktail of small molecules. These would help out the ribosomes to ignore the mutated stop codons. If the nonsense mutations can be ignored, the CFTR proteins will be functional. Full length proteins will then inhibit CF symptoms. Ain't it exquisite?